So after bits of grinding, I managed to get myself the pumpkin monster, which is one of the four vehicles, or well, one of the five vehicles you get from the Halloween update. And I'll be showing you the pumpkin monster, which is a five-seater vehicle. I don't really know what this is based off of. Assuming it's some like four-door sedan car with a modified front, because you know, obviously it's a monster, which actually looks pretty good, not gonna lie. I sort of underestimated this event because Siri Collins has been quite bad, even though it's not really that bad. And I actually got this just by opening base events, and despite being a 0.3% chance, still managed to get a legend Mega Crate. And the Mega Crate was, uh, you know, this cool looking vehicle. I still need the Pumpkin Killer, Pump, Pump Kill Jr., Phantom Glider, and maybe the, uh, and the treasure boat. Maybe the treasure boat, you know. But thank god I didn't got the ghost chest, ghost field, hunky skin, hollow's tower, or chrome and gunsky. Like, I don't really want any of those. Seriously though, I I, I literally don't. Besides, I have like three epic crates that I uh, haven't really touched yet, because I want to keep them as like a flex or something, you know. But um, let's just, let me just show you the vehicle itself. So here's the vehicle, and um, as you notice, it's a 5-seater, and it's quite fast, I don't know why. Considering the, this is actually a stock engine, so keep in mind, it has not customized it this yet. And personally, I really like this car at the front. Like I said, it's just way too cool. And despite, you know, being a difficult vehicle to get, it's actually kind of worth it. I mean, it's, it's, it's cool, right? Alright, let me just get to customization. I'll give you about the final thoughts my, of this vehicle. So here's, <coughs> here's the max out. Um, Pumpkin monster, and as you can see, I'm getting raindrops for some reason. I don't know why, I'm just gonna go down to graphics one so I can get. Yeah, there we go. Anyway, so here's the vehicle at max. Honestly, though, let's see how fast it can go being an event vehicle. Oops, I crashed it. And yes, I actually do have the pumpkin rooms, so you know, it can just patch along. The pumpkin, the pumpkin monster vehicle. Just to be clear, um, just to be clear, this vehicle is uh, okay. I'm just reading. Okay, I might just repeat myself, but whatever. So overall, the vehicle is decently fast. Actually, I'm not gonna lie, it's uh, yeah, it's, it has pretty good speed on like the Ranger, like. Okay, it's hard, like I, of course it's hard, but if you think about it, this car is quite fast, especially for like a beginner. I mean, for me as well, I'll still use it because it's, it's really fast. I mean, I think it's somewhat like your generic uh, low price supercar or something like that. I don't really know how to describe it. We can kind of tell by the speed, and there is nitro, but there's no nitro effects, which is kind of a bummer, but. As long as I get the, as long as uh, it doesn't really matter because the vehicle itself really looks pretty cool enough for sure. So yeah, hope you guys do enjoy this video and be sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And right now, I'll see you in the next video and goodbye.